Hello there, you guys. Welcome back. Ooh, wait. Okay, good. I thought my audio wasn't working for a second. I'm like, wait, no. Two o'clock song is just incredibly quiet in New Leaf for some reason. Um, yeah, welcome back, everyone. I hope everyone is having a fantastic Tuesday. Um, it's hot. <laughs> um, I, I just tweeted out, if you guys haven't seen it um, or weren't in chat earlier, um, my AC is broken, or at least it's not working at the moment. Maybe it isn't broken. Maybe Mike can fix it when he comes over on Thursday. But it's gonna be hot. I'm gonna be taking a lot of breaks. I have water. I have my energy drink. I'm hopefully gonna be fine. <laughs> um, I have a fan on at my feet to keep my feet cool. Like, I got everything going as much as I can. So, <laughs> hopefully we're gonna be fine. Um, but yeah, I'm sorry if I'm a little, a little bit spacey today or just a little bit quiet. I'm tired. I didn't sleep very well last night. I got maybe like three hours total. Um, but I hope everyone else is having a fantastic day. <laughs> Um, so, Gumbelinus, which by the way, Gumbelinus, you say you're new, but I recognize that username from somewhere. Maybe I'm just misremembering that, but I just feel like we had another Gumbelinus in here at some point. Maybe, it's probably not you, but like, <laughs> just, just interesting. Uh, Nisha Crossing, of course, you've been in here as well with me. Uh, Red Arrow, hello, hello. Cinnamon Wade, uh, Cass Hockey, Sierra, uh, Plant, Plant Link, hello. I'm saying that right. Dear Callie, hello, hello. Bulwark mode, but listening, that's cool, no worries. Uh, Nintendo Modder, hello. Uh, CC, Kitty Cat, how are you guys? Lesbian Percy Weasley, welcome on in. Welcome on in, everyone. Victorine, hello, you're on time. Yes, you are, we only really just went live, so you guys are all good to go. <laughs> Don't melt, I'll try not to. Um, you guys will know if my brain starts to melt out of my ears, just, it's, it'll be fine, I promise. Uh, Matt Girl, CGW, hello. Come on in, you guys. Um, so plans for today. It's another cloudy day in memory, which kind of sucks, um, but it's not raining, so that's always good. <laughs> um, Katie, thank you so very much for the biddies. Uh, completely fine. Thank you so much, Katie. <laughs> um, so yeah, we're gonna have a really chill, just relaxing stream in memory today. Um, we have some public works project stuff I want to do. We have some hybrid breeding I want to do. Um... Just stuff like that, making sure our villagers are all loved. I was thinking maybe if my brain isn't leaking by then, uh, doing some desert island escape, but we'll see about that. Hi, Dagger. How's it going? Ashley, hello. Uh, Sim Simmer Sass, hello. How's it going? Double rainbow in my town today. Oh, very nice. I don't think we've had any rainbows in memory yet. I could be wrong, but I don't think so. Summer Sunflower. Lunette, hello. Welcome on in. Manly, welcome back. Raging Penguin, hello. Flautista. <laughs> so from your soccer game on Sunday, everything hurts. Oh no. Hopefully you can like take a bath and relax. Yes, we might die today. We might. We might. Swag Moo, hello. Oh, down the other one, Bridge. Yes, Cece, that is our main public works project thing, so. Um, Hagenite, hello. Popping in and out, trying to study. Oh, best of luck with your studying. Hi, Lucas. How's it going? <laughs> oh, welcome, Villainous. I hope you have a good birthday. Uh, cat's currently climbing all over you. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't let Tiger in here while I'm streaming because he would be doing the same thing to me, trust me. I know. <laughs> but yeah, um... I'm kind of hoping we can get lucky again with some public works projects today, but... Or a public works project, but... Uh, Shmoopy and Matsuri, welcome on in, you guys. Dream Note Princess, hello. And Matsuri and Lucas, thank you so very much for the host, both of you. Time to go eat breakfast at 2.05 in the afternoon. Heck yeah, I love that. <laughs> uh, Simon, you enjoy your lurk, no worries. Can I find the walking leaf? Yeah, that's one actually we're going to be searching for today as well, so. Hopefully you get it, hopefully we get it. Boxfire, hello? Do you be playing Tetris? Are you playing uh, Tetris 99 or like a different version of Tetris? Night, hello? Make some soup, can't eat anything else with the stomach virus. Oh no, dagger, Ooh, Stomach viruses are not fun, those are painful. <laughs> There's no hello. You're hyped, heck yeah. Love the enthusiasm. <laughs> oh, nice, Matt, sorry. Got to get Super TNT. The shop closes tomorrow for the remodel. Very nice, CC. Very nice. All right, guys, let's go ahead. Switch on over. Um, welcome back to memory. <laughs> um, today, if you guys missed the agenda earlier, uh, what we're going to be doing is public works projects first and foremost we have a bridge to put down and actually a bridge to take up as well um we have 
hybrid breeding we have of course our usual dailies and i want to we have a lot of bugs that we can catch right now so i'm going to try and aim for those katie thank you so much for the biddies put down the next wooden bridge exactly yes <laughs> um manly i like two wide paths personally but I find if it's like in front of an important area, like the town hall train station, kind of, I put three. It depends though. It depends. What, whatever you want, really. Uh, Delirious Clown, hello. Welcome on in. Uh, Caden is smarter, hello. Watching the VOD and stream simultaneously. Oh my goodness, that's a lot of me. Oh. <laughs> um, going on with you, just built the- oh, the Wisteria Trellis, very nice. Uh, I'm crossing the do you have any tips to get villagers photos? Um. Honestly, just talk with them every day, do whatever requests they want, just never say no to them. Eventually you'll get it. It's honestly, it just, it takes a while. I should also mention, uh, yesterday after stream, Ace Tick was very, very generous and gifted me, I know it sounds silly, gifted me some garbage so that we can hopefully get the fly today. So I'm going to put these down somewhere and hope that a fly comes by. I don't really know how, how it's going to work. gloomy memory today it is and i don't know why it's kind of been a gloomy little while for memory uh, epic joy by the way hello never had a story trails in my town just never find a good spot yeah do i have the ant um yes we got ants saturday from putting down candy which was really awesome <laughs> uh played my first town 100 percent yesterday very nice I too enjoy receiving garbage from other people. <laughs> it was like one of the funniest things to thank someone for. It's like, hey, thanks for your garbage. Like, it just is. <laughs> Hi, Kira and Elvis. Welcome on in. Zach Crossing as well. Game around the landscaping in the new town. Best of luck. Panda lover, by the way. Hello, hello. So from Gaston to Crystal, thanks for coming uh, to hang out the other day. Oh, and thanks for going easy on my room. This isn't really much, but it's still a gift for the kind words. Enjoy. Do it. <laughs> Gabster, thank you very much for the follow. Welcome on in. Um, I think that June to early July is the in-game raising- Yeah, I think so as well. Like, all of June, pretty much. It rained every time I streamed. It was not fun. <laughs> uh, you prefer gloomy weather a lot more recently. Oh, maybe it's because it's been so hot for you? Yeah, I, I'm still- I love the sunshine. I love the heat, but, like, not when it's killing me in my room, <laughs> slowly. Um, Gabster, how are you doing today? I'm- I am the garbage that everyone takes into their lives. Same. Ah. It's the tarantula. Can you imagine, Cass Hockey? Nice, Matt, sir. Yeah, we did have- I have a turnip in my inventory right here. I have ten turnips. Um, but unfortunately, it does take a while for it to rot, so. Uh, Blue, thank you very much for the follow. Welcome on in. Working on paths, it stresses me out so much. There's so much in the way. Paths can be really frustrating. Uh, from Midge, Dear Crystal, bought this pretty stationery the other day and just had to use it. Besides, I want to be the kind of friend who writes frequent letters that shows that you care. I love Midge. Midge is, Midge is awesome. She wrote me another letter, but let me see what Gaston gave me. Birch flooring. Very cute. Uh, kind of abandoned my town. Doing okay, still trying to wake up. Oh, no worries, but welcome on in. I'm glad you enjoyed the content. Uh, is it Amy Lou? Hello. Mary.com, welcome on in. Charisma, hello. And there we go, Ace Tick, hello, I was just telling people about the garbage. <laughs> and you caught the scorpion, very nice, congrats on that. Congrats on that. Itsu, with that tier 2 11 month resub, Crystal notice me. I have noticed, Itsu. <laughs> Thank you so much, right? you're one month away from a year and that's a little bit scary. Thank you so very much, dude. Very much appreciated. Um... For Crystal the Collector, thanks for letting me see your collection of rare things the other day. This little gift isn't very impressive, but I really wanted to send you a thank you gift. I'm intrigued from Midge. That is Phoebe's present. There we go. <laughs> Midge sent us. Oh, I think I like that one, actually. Hey, Crystal, I've been raising this flower extra carefully and it finally bloomed. I have to celebrate with someone, so I'm sharing this with you. But don't tell anyone or they'll want one from the happy Phoebe. Is it common for villagers to send flowers like that? Because I appreciate that very much. I, I like- oh my goodness, I feel blessed. <laughs> I 
never supposed to rain for it to be summery in that customer's mind, probably. <laughs> Ian, hello? Not at all. What's with the boot and dyer? We're trying to get the fly. <laughs> um, so into my Nintendo Switch, so I haven't played the 3DS in a while. What games are you enjoying on the Switch, if you don't mind my asking? Christy villagers sometimes send flowers? Now I know. <laughs> I think BB secretly loves you, but she's got a reputation to preserve. No, I think so too. 100%. <laughs> um. Gucci villagers, yeah. Uh, who's the other Gumbelna she said earlier might have been my sis? I have no clue, honestly. They haven't been in in a while. I just recognize the username. Just Gumbella Niss, I think, by itself, maybe? Maybe it had numbers after? I haven't seen them in a while, though. <laughs> Creeps in. Hello. Hi, Pepper. How's it going? Alright, so we got some, actually some really nice stuff in my letters today. Um, I also got a classic sofa from somewhere. <laughs> cool. Is you forever get pink tulip tulips? Yes, I think, yeah, we already have a couple up here, but like, we don't have very many, so I'm gonna put it right here, and this is forever known as Phoebe's tulip. Everyone remember that one specifically. <laughs> Random... Uh, I'd make a rubbish pump, but I'm too tired. Maybe if I'm still a boot. Oh my goodness. Oh wait, 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 that that butterfly. I think I need that for my... Where's my net? Where's my net? Hello? There we go. I think that's one that I needed. Come here. Hi, friend. Is that the Raja Brook? It is. Awesome. So that was one butterfly that I needed. Which, by the way, once again, you guys, exclamation mark museum if you want to see my huge spreadsheet I have for um, all the bugs and fish and collectible stuff I need for the museum. Baby's Tulip sounds like a children's book or song. It kind of does. It kind of does. Okay, so keep that separate from everything else. Hi, Cruel World. How are you doing today? Hope you're having a good day. I love you. I'm crossing New Horizons. Hello. How's it going? <laughs> Nectarine, thank you. <laughs> Nia, hello, how's it going? Welcome on in. Okay, um, I'm gonna put down stuff I don't need <laughs> at the moment. Um, did I want any of... I might keep that birch flooring, because I have a soft spot for that one. <laughs> Sometimes I don't even know. Welcome back, how are you doing today? I on my computer that has everything I can catch at the moment. I click a button, it will mark it as... Oh, that's interesting. I've seen that advertises an app on the phone, but it never worked for me when I tried it out a very long time ago now. Playing Bayonetta. Bayonetta 2, very nice. I haven't played the series myself, but I've heard a lot of good things. Played together at his island and he told me not to take any of his villagers. Well, guess who moved? Oh no! <laughs> Did you accidentally take one home with you? Everyone should know random. <laughs> it is. Hello, start marching band tonight. I'm so excited. Best of luck. I hope you have fun. I'm not musically inclined at all, so I never really got to participate in much of the music stuff growing up, but I I have a lot of admiration for people who are. <laughs> you already forgot which one? It's okay, I remember. I'll go point it out. Watch as I can't point it out. <laughs> Epster, thank you. If you want to use the paths, by the way, these are not made by me. Um, you can type in exclamation mark path, I believe it is, in chat. Uh, and for the record, this is Phoebe's tulip. Maybe. <laughs> okay, also, I'm gonna go donate the butterfly really quick just before I accidentally sell it or give it away because I don't trust myself. Um, at all. Let's <laughs> say so cute, so I'm glad she moved in. Oh, she's actually a very nice soldier. It's Phoebe's flower because it cost a fee <laughs> being there. Oh my goodness. Gotta remember now? Awesome. Awesome. Well, y'all have to, like, praise that tulip because I I love I love the fact that she can send us flowers. Praise tulip emote <laughs> to go along with praise rock. <laughs> oh no, Pepper. Take some vitamin C. Drink a whole lot of water. Time to fight off whatever is... Making me feel down. Hi, Castbot. How's it going? Welcome on in. 
My museum is on the left. It is, yes. Um, every single Animal Crossing New Leaf town I've had, it's always been on the left. But I've seen a lot of people who have it on the right, and that always weirds me out. <laughs> um, I think someone has explained it has something to do with what side the cliff is on in your town, and it'll always be on the opposite side, I think it is. So apparently I'm just- I'm drawn towards towns that have a cliff on a certain side. Also, pickled water, thank you very much for the follow. Welcome on in. Just woke up and mean to get up earlier? Oh no. Well, I hope you had a good sleep. And Grace Hope, welcome on in. Come on in, you guys. So, pet owners out there, <laughs> uh, I have a story about Tiger to share with you guys today. He has been so incredibly demanding. Do you guys remember a couple of weeks ago, he had a little bit of a health scare. Um, and he's doing better now. Um, but he... He's gotten very, very used to us giving him extra food. We've been giving him canned cat food, which he usually gets dry cat food. And he's been getting it like twice a day, and he gets really, really demanding. <laughs> like, I, I can't make it out of the kitchen without him yelling at me. It's really funny. I need to take a video of it sometime. And uh, it's, it's honestly gotten to the point where like, I'm just happy to see him eating because he's an old cat. <laughs> but like... Oh my goodness, his yelling makes it sound like I'm murdering him, but I'm literally just telling him, no, your food isn't, you know, room temperature yet or something like that, because we keep it in the fridge just in case. You were camping all weekend. Well, I hope you had fun. And I, I hope, I'm, I'm glad you enjoyed the Slumber Party stream as well. Is he getting dry food too? Yes. Yes, he is. Um, It's kind of gone to the point where... Giving him pure cat, uh, canned food isn't good for his kidneys, but it's one of the only things he'll really eat. And he's so old anyway, we're kind of just like, you eat this and we'll be happy. Um, which is kind of a sad point to be at, but he's, he's an old cat, so we do what we can. Busy body. She wakes me up at 5 a.m. Oh no. Oh, and she's so young too. The dog's dinner, she runs around the couch and jumps up. No food for Tiger every 10 minutes? That's what he thinks. He thinks anytime someone goes in the kitchen, he's gonna be fed. And he'll yell at you until you do. Oh, Zach, that's cute. Keep my cat treats in our pantry, and every time we open the pantry for something else, she runs forward. Oh. <laughs> um, I have a bag over there of, um, Teddy Grahams, like those little, like, animal cracker type cookies, right? Um, or biscuits, whatever you want to say. And, um... It's the same kind of like Ziploc top bag as their treat bag, the cat's treat bag, so they all get really weird when they hear it open. Um, oh! <laughs> I'm talking about my cat and then I have a raid coming. Hi, little gaming group! I've been watching you since like 6 this morning. How are you doing? What's up, you guys? Welcome on in! Welcome on in, you guys. My name is Crystal. We're playing some Animal Crossing New Leaf. We're literally just about to start our dailies. Could we get a shout out for Hi, little gaming group? He is one of the most chill streamers I think I know ever. He's just so many positive, literally morning positive vibes, right? So, or positive morning vibes? Positive morning vibes sounds a bit more correct. Welcome on in, you guys. Welcome on in. Guys, go give him a follow if you guys enjoy Animal Crossing. I watched him play City Folk, Wild World, and GameCube this morning. <laughs> uh, Rock Salad, Yakuza, and the Dr. Mario. Welcome on in. Thank you so much for the follows, the both of you. Hi. <laughs> the Weary Warlord, hello, how are you doing? There we go, there's a second Bob there. Also, I'm sorry, I need to scroll because I saw two people had pinged me just here. The other day for Animal Crossing New Horizons would be interesting to see a picture of the actual family of the villager. The fools we hear about brothers and sisters. Oh, that would be cute, Lucas, that would be cute. And... Uh... 13 hours for the rest of the week, so I'll be missing your other streams this week. It's okay, Cruel World. It's totally, totally fine. Oh gosh, sorry, I'm missing a little bit of chat here. Also, <laughs> I will gaming group with that two-month resub. Had to get my bobs back. <laughs> Thank you so very much. Thank you. It's incredible. You guys have to go follow him and check him out. He's much better spoken than I am. <laughs> very relaxing to listen to early in the morning. He's literally what I 
he's my first thing in the morning thing. I have him on all day until I go live, pretty much, if he's still, if he's still live himself. Oh, that's confusing. The Dr. Mario, it looks like he just followed twice. Confusing. <laughs> um, and Rosu... Rosu Bado? Am I saying your name right? Thank you very much for the follow. Welcome on in. Welcome on in, you guys. This is my town memory. Um, we've had this town for just over six months now. It's kind of my goodbye to New Leaf, so our goals are like to, to finish the entire um, museum to get like the perfect town. Like We already have the perfect town, but um, up to my standards, <laughs> if you know what I mean. So that's kind of what we have going on right now. It's just been doing the double fall thing. Oh, has it? Okay. Interesting. I guess we're going to have a lot more Bob Bob dancing today. <laughs> Inception. <laughs> Marshall Dreams, hello. How are you doing? Why is there trash near the light up public works project? We're trying to get the the um the fly. Um, Ace Tick very generously donated trash, which is amazing. Uh, to me, because we have the beautiful town ordinance, we actually can't fish up any garbage. And we need it to get the fly for the museum, so... Pretty much what we're doing. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's a normal dailies now. So if you guys are new here, pretty much our dailies kind of consist of walking around town, fossils, hybrids, and talking with our villagers, making sure no one wants to move out. <laughs> never finished the museum in like any of my towns. Yeah, I, I never have either. I finished different exhibits, but not all of them. And that's kind of what I'm going for, so. Uh, Mermaid Cove, welcome on in. How are you doing today? It's actually a monument dedicated to me. Oh, Kazakh. Oh, I feel that though. It applies, you can get a radish from- Oh, you mean like a turnip? Yeah, I actually do have one and I was gonna wait for it to rot, but I would have to wait until like next Sunday for it to rot, so I just figured this might be faster. Uh, King Kanato? Am I saying that right? Thank you very much for the follow. Welcome on in. How are you doing today? This guy did them. Hello. Oh, you're dyeing your hair? What color are you dyeing it? That's cool. Let me come over, Crystal. I am trash. No, 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 Pepper. It's okay. I'm trash by myself. <laughs> I, can, I should probably be able to attract them on my own. <laughs> Looked on Stardew again, and I'm just gonna blame you. I take that blame. Stardew is an amazing game. It needs more, uh, more people. Want to hop in stream and say that I've been watching your memory playlist from the beginning these past two weeks because it helps calm my anxiety while my husband is deployed. Oh, I'm happy to hear about that. Thank you so much for coming on over and checking out the live stream as well. And uh, I'm just happy you've been enjoying them, honestly. Okay, none of my villagers are in their houses today except for Mitch. Uh, time travel, Ross tramps. Yeah, I heard, but I wasn't sure how many days in advance I'd have to go. Also, Weary the Warlord, uh, played New Leaf because I needed a new- or sorry, a game to play on 3S other than Pokemon X, but then I saw the gardens people had. And really tried to make mine as party. <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, there's a lot of really creative people in this game who do amazing, amazing towns. Hot pink. <laughs> um, I'd love to dye my hair, but I don't want to be- oh, like, dyed in school? Yeah. I, uh, my hair color just- Nah. <laughs> I think I only look decent with this, so. It sounded creepy. Oh, right. Midge does have a really pretty song in her house, but it has like a really creepy segment midway through. I usually try and talk over it. <laughs> oh, Dagger, you should. Record him sometime, put it on the Discord. I want to see it. <laughs> her giant moth. Yeah, I think that's actually... Did we need to donate that? <laughs> I don't think so. I think I already donated it when I gave her one. Oh, musical. I hope you're enjoying it. Your trip from Wisconsin ended up finishing. Oh, Pokemon Ultramarine. Did you enjoy it, Cruel World? Just read a long article about the Horned Hercules. Now it's my new favorite. Bug. I feel silly for asking this, but do you think you could catch one for me? I can try. I don't know if those are out right now. So dye my hair aerial red, had to turn it down for work. That sounds pretty though. Love it. Um, actually, you know what? I shouldn't be watering these. I should be focusing on the blue rose. 
Katie, thank you so very much for the biddies. All of any color, in my opinion. I wish. Like, sometimes I want to dye it, like, crazy colors. Especially because now I'm doing this full-time and I'm not working in an office. But, like, part of me is like, no. Like, you'll be embarrassed going outside, even though I think it's cool looking. I, I, uh, I flip-flop back and forth on that one a lot. And then I worry about, like, taking it out of my hair and getting it looking back to normal. <laughs> Uh, Seal, Seal and Cat, I'm not saying that right. Thank you very much for the follow, welcome on in. Ah, ooh, Astrid, hello. Public works project, maybe. I wonder if you could help me out. You see, I splurged on something recently. It's nothing, really just a gold screen wall. Okay, I will buy that from you. You've pledged your allegiance to the Empire. Oh no, there's another one. Ah. Girls gold right now. You look good with purple hair? I'd love like purplish blue, but like that's just, that's just me. <laughs> Use hair chalk. I've never looked into that pepper. I have no idea how any of that works. I'm fascinated though. Playing Stardew can't decide if I want to marry Shane or Emily. I'm biased, I'd say Emily. <laughs> I'm not a huge Shane fan. No worries, Cloud Prince. Okay, and by the way, if you guys see any fossils that I walk by and just happen to miss, please do let me know. I'm usually blind when I'm talking to chat. Uh, Pixels, hello, how are you doing today? I've had blue hair for almost a year now. <laughs> Musical, it's okay, it's okay. It won't affect my actual town. Jacob, off any color you want. Experiment is a great way to express yourself. I wish, like, I, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. I'm very tempted. I'll, I'll have to talk to Mike about it. <laughs> Pixels, thank you so much for the follow, by the way. Uh, Christian, hello, how's it going? You saw about purple and blue? So when you live closer, I can do all these things to your hair. Pepper, we do. You need to come visit. Also, why is Kevin's house so incredibly quiet? You need some music in your life, buddy. I think PJ shirt is one of my favorite. Where did you get that from? <laughs> I saw you walk past the fossil. His name's Mike. <laughs> he is very old. <laughs> Alina, by the way, hello. I've seen some cream that colors your hair and then you can shampoo it off. I'm intrigued because you can't decide whether you want to dye your hair. Ooh. I wonder how well that works though, how like vibrant it is and stuff like that. Uh, I saw Gaston. Oh, there he is. We have to talk to Gaston. If you guys are new here, Gaston's a little bit of a celebrity. You just disappear. Did, is he blending in with some flowers and I'm just... Bob is right there. Oh, no, there he is. <laughs> you know, if you're interested, you can come over to my house. It's great to see such a stunningly awesome decoration job, Loki. Uh, Gaston's house. He's a, he's a wonderful villager, but his house is... Interesting. <laughs> uh, Tracy Kosa, hello, how are you doing? So how many randoms do we have now? I've lost count. I lost count a long time ago. All I know is that if I go and raid or host someone and they see randoms coming into chat, it's always enough for them to say, oh, that's kind of weird. I always get the comment on it. Oh gosh, you have to give me the time. Okay, that's only- someone remind me. Remind me at 2.55 that we are seeing Gaston at 3 because I'm going to forget. Not now, don't remind me now. <laughs> Never mind, remind me- that was weird. Remind me at 3.25. <laughs> I've never seen him change the time like that before. That was weird. Am I a random yet? You are indeed. <laughs> uh, first time I dyed my hair I started off with dark purple because I was too anxious about having bright hair. It's two and a half years later and now I'm fluorescent. <laughs> It's kind of fun. Maybe I, I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. Tempting sometimes. Uh, no, Bob, I'm good. I don't need a break. I love how Gaston is just like creeping in on this conversation. <laughs> he's he's definitely a part of it. Mm -hmm. 
Did you know I had a chat with Lily Lake from Cecilia? Wait, that's not right. I meant I had a chat with Cecilia from Lily Lake. Hopefully I'm saying that name right. Now she's one heck of a world traveler, don't you think? Shout out to whoever that is. Yeah, you know what, Katie? I think what just happened is they usually will ask you an hour in advance. And when I was talking to him, it literally just changed from 2.29 to 2.30. So that may have been what happened. That may have very dark brown boring, I know. Platinum lawn, I would love to do it again. Did you find dyeing your hair to such a light shade? Did you find that did any damage to your hair? I'm just kind of curious. I always imagine if you go from dark to like very, very light, you're probably doing some, some damage to it. Also, by the way, new bridge. Um, this is probably some of your guys' first time seeing it. And I actually really love the bridge. I'm not sure if the paths go with it or not. So I'm kind of, I'm, I have a couple of paths already saved. I already have them bookmarked um, for ones that I could use to replace these ones, but I'm still, sorry, I'm not, I'm not too sure. It's a bleach it, yeah. Which is always gonna damage your hair, yeah. Do you even have any hair left? See, that's, that scares me a bit. <laughs> Always go to a salon? Yeah. You like a lighter path? Yeah, I have a couple lighter wood ones as well as a couple cobblestone ones, which I wanted to go wood for this town, but it's hard to find really nice light ones that I like. You also love Yeah, I like the brick one as well. We had a silly hair day. I got washable color spray. I did half yellow, half purple. Turned out green. <laughs> oh no. That's beautiful though. But yeah, I, I l really love the bridge. It's just the paths. Change its color, so I bought some hair dye. It was a type of- Oh, random! Mmm, making that hair loss pun. Okay, um... How many fossils? We have one fossil so far. Okay. We're off to a really good start. Godzilla, hello, hello. Yes, I, I do. I actually stream every day at, at uh, 2 p.m. EST. Um, occasionally I'll stream a bit earlier or a bit later, but uh, unless I say otherwise, it's every single day. <laughs> no school me decided that she my hair was a good look for some reason. Oh no. I've dyed my hair once when I was younger. It was a very, very bad job, mind you. It wasn't me who did it personally. It was a family friend who kind of used bleach and then just went like just brushed over the outer layer almost if you know what i mean it was it was a bad time uh and it turned it into more of like a strawberry blonde color and it took me years to fully grow it all out it was awful so i'm a little bit jaded maybe because of that so what blonde boys do heck yeah <laughs> Outlier color paths would go more with the Enchanted Forest theme as well. Yeah. Yeah. Mm, okay. Fossils. No fossils. Kaden, that's 100% normal. Whatever you like is really the main thing, right? Um, I've heard of people who just really dislike paths, and as long as, like, you know, you're not putting others down for using them, that's totally fine. Uh, oh! Aren't you in our city folk town? What's your name again? Oh no, I'm blanking. Uh... Twig- Twiggy? No. Yes? Hmm. The fossil by the fountain. There's one by a fountain? Wait. <laughs> which, 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 which fountain? Do I only have one fountain? So I dyed my hair, I wanted to go to a darker shade of brown than my natural blonde brown, so I chose a chestnut dye. You went ginger? Oh no! Also curly, top crisp, so you have naturally drier hair. Yes, yes. Let me just make sure there aren't any fossils in here, because I feel like this is probably where I'm losing them. Oh, no, there's something. One fossil. Oh, Zach, that makes me a little bit nervous. 
Or should people who have dirt paths that aren't hacked? Yes, dirt paths can be really annoying to maintain, and it's why I don't bother with them. It's just too much work. By the town hall. Okay, I'll go over there and check next, then. I have my hair a lot in high school and I miss it, but I guess I've just gotten lazy to keep up with it. That's the other thing. You gotta, like, you know, maintain. And I'm, I'm lazy. <laughs> to put it simply, I'm very lazy. Um, there's a reason why I get along so well with the lazy villagers in this game, I swear. Uh, oh, there's one. Is this the one you're talking about? It seems to be the closest. Orchard hides many secrets. Fossils, bugs, what's left of Moose's house. <laughs> Great. Wait. Is that where Moose's house was? I've actually forgotten where my villagers' houses were originally. Except for, except for Cole. I remember where he was. Or dirt path. So it's literally just when you trample down the dirt, just like here, and you use that to path your village to make paths between the different buildings and such. Dog cries for me, let him outside. As soon as I let him out, he cries because he wants to go inside. See, he wants the door open. That's my cat does that as well. He just he doesn't want the door to be closed, he wants to have free access. <laughs> Take advantage of coloring my hair, but once I get a job, I'll go back to brown again. Yeah, like, you might as well while you have the freedom to do so, right? Moose was below yours and to the right. Right, he was near the pond, wasn't he? Um, okay, you're not meant to be in this town. See the new sword shield gym leaders? I did, I did. I'm actually really excited for that. I know there's been a lot of shade towards sword and shield. I think that it looks like they are actually working on it. It looks like it it looks nice. <laughs> and I think the idea of having separate different gym leaders and stuff like that between the two versions of the game is really cool. I like it. Um, mind you, I like the ghost one better than the fighting one, but I'm still getting sword. <laughs> I'll just watch Mike do it. Andrew, hello, how are you doing? We're missing a fossil. I think we've been missing a fossil for a couple days though. Six more fossils to complete the fossil collection. Hopefully you get them soon. I know it can take a while when you have like just a couple left. Uh, Rezu, no worries. You have a fantastic one. We'll see you later. You have the same problem, but you like sword better? Yeah, I'm, I'm going for sword because it's I think it's like the blue blue version, so. Robert Chu, hello, how are you doing? I hope you're having a good like work day. <laughs> Is there a fossil near my house? Okay, I'll go back and check that in a second here. We want to buy both, think I'm gonna get sword though. Yeah, Mike and I plan on getting the- they're selling the dual pack where they sell them together. Um, just because, um, for the last couple of games we bought Sun and Moon together. Um, we bought um, Let's Go Eevee and Pikachu together, but mine came in day one, his didn't. So that way, if they're being shipped together, at least we know. <laughs> if it's gonna be late, we'll both start on the same day regardless. That's the main thing. Uh, Connor, hello, how are you doing? People aren't set by our direction of the games, which are on point anyway. I really like them. I don't- I- I think it looks great. <laughs> Uh, Ellie Beach, glad I have you on Twitter. This is the only channel I don't get notification for. I wonder why. I wonder why. <laughs> but welcome on in. I hope you're having a good day. Okay, so I'm gonna go nip by my house real quick and see if I can't find that fossil you guys were mentioning. Um, I think I've been missing a fossil for a couple days, so I'm, I'm assuming it's hidden behind something there. Connor, I'm doing pretty good. Don't have to say Pokemon. Mega, su Mega Super Dynamax designs or whatever aren't my cup of tea. I like Pokemon to actually seem like a beast, not... Yeah, yeah, it's... I don't know if that mechanic is gonna be that cool for me, but at the same time, I'm just happy for a new Pokemon game on a console. <laughs> Crazy Unicorn, hello, how are you doing? Did I need that? I may need that. If that's a banded dragonfly, then I need it. Where did it go? I'm really bad at bug catching. Never mind. <laughs> I did it! Banded dragonfly, there we go. 
Uh, once again, by the way, if you guys are new for the people who are just coming in from uh, Hedlion's Raid, uh, you can type in exclamation mark museum if you want to see what we have left to catch. Um, or collect for the museum. <laughs> Oh, also, Jimbo, how are you doing today, dude? Welcome on in. No fly yet. Um, okay, now, was there a fossil back here that I've been missing? Not seeing one. Change your pants into a cake is awesome. I mean, that's pretty cute. It seems ridiculous, but it's cute. <laughs> um, can't complain? Awesome, awesome. Man, where... Where are my fossils today? If you have no luck with the fly, not just yet. We only just put this stuff down like right at the very beginning of stream, so I'm not expecting it for a little while. I might end up doing like some save and continuing, uh, but we'll have to see. Uh, Logan, I'm doing pretty good. Green Fairy, hello, not at all. We've it's been a very chill beginning of stream, I'm not gonna lie. We've had a very chill kind of day so far. Okay, so all we have left to catch that we can currently catch right now, at least, is the Orchid Mantis, which is that one that only sits on white flowers, which is really annoying. <laughs> um, Walking Leaf, which is the one, I think, that disguises itself as an item leaf on the ground. A Ladybug, which is obvious. Uh, Jewel Beetle, which I've been hunting for for a while, and the Fly, of course. Blue Pokemon are delicious. I mean, amazing. <laughs> Darn hungry. Oh, boy. And I'm calling Officer Jetty. <laughs> um, okay. Let me donate this, at least, before I accidentally sell it, because that would not be the first time. Oh, Rain Fairy, we just kind of- we did a little bit of our dailies just now. I caught a couple bugs that we needed. Uh, we had a very generous raid from, uh, from Hyrule Gaming Group, and it's just been a very chill day so far. Oh, Titus! <laughs> Thank you so very much for the face, Titus. Um, I was lurking in your stream last night. Did you ever- Get the- I always forget the name of this Pokemon. Were you going for a shiny... Omanite? I'm forgetting the name of my fossil Pokemon. <laughs> I lurk. I'm, I'm a hardcore lurker. I, I wanted to say hello, but I'm shy, so... Razipu, hello! How's it going? Welcome back! Looking for a bit in a gaming group stream this morning. I think he said he was going for... Ten yeah. No, he he does really long streams. I don't know how I don't I don't understand how you can just sit there and do that and I have so much respect for it. I haven't shiny hunting in eons. I'm looking forward to shiny hunting in Sword and Shield. I'm interested to see what they kind of introduce. Because they seem to be introducing new mechanics every single time. Who was the first random? I'm curious. Me, Pepper. I I'm pretty sure random was, but okay. <laughs> I was going for and unfortunately not thanks for lurk that's mostly what I do as well yeah yeah well I hope you get it soon I uh, I never had the patience for like software setting shiny hunting I always preferred um, the uh, I forget what, what do they do they was there even a term for shiny hunting in that game So, Reese, am I saying your name right? Welcome on in. Uh, looking for a doctor appointment when I arrived. They left a note on the door saying there was a power outage and they can't see anyone today. I should have another appointment tomorrow morning, but I was really looking forward to that appointment. Oh, well, I'm glad you managed to get one for tomorrow morning, at least. This is girl, I can see why. They're the same name. <laughs> um, okay, Pully Bear, do you want that? Yeah, why not? You can have that. 
Uh, Robert Chu, thank you very much for that Twitch Prime sub. I hope you enjoyed the emotes. Thank you so very much for that. Oh gosh, my thing isn't working. There we go. There's my love. <laughs> I hope you enjoy them. Thank you so very much for the support. Um, okay, awesome. Their software setting, it's quicker. I also don't have to keep killing poor innocent non shiny boys. That's why I really liked um, Let's Go's uh, bu uh, bug catching, Pokemon catching system because you didn't actually knock them out or anything like that. Um, but I can definitely see what you mean. I'm just so scared it's going to be muscle memory and I'll like reset over it if you know what I mean. I've seen I've seen stream fails of that happening before. I really want to know where this other fossil is. Uh, just be looking today. Really want some be more involved in this community, but I don't feel really well. It's okay if you're not feeling well. You just relax and you take it easy. Totally understand. Subscribe, but I'm broke. That's 100% fine. I never ever feel obligated to do that. It's just extra support if you can, if you feel like it. I'm just happy people are here and people want to chat. <laughs> The random crit- no, you guys, no. Oh, wait. I want to water these today, because I keep forgetting. Uh, Grady, hello! I'm glad you enjoy it. Oh, Cloud Prince, no! Oh, that's so frustrating. Silver Palm, you're gonna be lurking while at work? No worries. No worries, enjoy your- Enjoy your work, hopefully. <laughs> Um, okay, nothing here, nothing here. That was the jewel beetle, wasn't it? Gosh darn it. <laughs> I think that was one we were hunting for. And Jude, you really like that quote. Uh, oh, this guy did and it's just gifted a sub to the random Caden. I hope you enjoy the emotes. There you go. <laughs> love in chat, you guys. Extra love in chat for the... Uh, gifted service guy down. Thank you so very much for that. Very much appreciated. I really, really, really want to know where this fossil is. Oh, hi, Bob. Where this fossil is? <laughs> hey, I have an important question for you. Do you like sweet or spicy food? I always answer this the same. I'm, I'm very bland. <laughs> I'm boring when it comes to food. Fishing while listening, so relaxing. Oh, very nice. Um, see, whenever I usually am missing a fossil, it's usually up behind Astrid's house because I don't really come up here very often. But I don't think it's there today. Bob, stop! I crave sweets. <laughs> oh. Okay. Um. Did we talk to Eric today? I don't know if we spoke to Eric today. If you guys are new here, um, all of the villagers in this town are amiibo move-ins, which means... Found Colton as well. <laughs> um, which means uh, they have pretty much a normal chance of asking to move out. So whenever I stream, whenever I play this game, I make it a note to talk to every single villager just in case. They asked to leave, because if someone asks to leave, that means I have to plot reset a villager back in, and it's just gonna be a bad time. <laughs> Colton, you changed your shirt, buddy. Earlier, I found a book called The Trog Troglo Troglodyte? Am I saying that right? Diet on the cabin bookcase. That sounds strange. I wouldn't have expected it, but Eric reads some pretty difficult books. It assures me that he's reading at a higher level than I am. What has my life become? <laughs> Look at these dorks plotting the end of memory. No, these are good boys. This Eric is. Love Eric, he's one of your favorites. Yeah, he's a sweetheart. He's really great. Colton is visiting too, being popular is super sweet. When you're collecting fruit, do you- Oh, he's just gonna give me the you can stack fruit dialogue. Uh, Grotti, have you ever heard of the diving trick? It's a decent way that you can use to get more public works budget suggestions, supposedly. It's not 
like, you know, entirely guaranteed. But if you're having trouble, it's what I usually would do if you're looking for more. Okay. So I'm gonna kind of start keeping an eye out for, um... Especially on white flowers. <laughs> I need to I need to find this uh, orchid mantis, which actually, on my list, it does say that it can spawn on the island. So do you guys think it would be worth it for me to go to the island and put down a white flower and just keep spawning around and hoping that it spawns on the flower? Would that work? It might work, because I have a lot of flowers in memory and a lot of stuff that bugs can spawn on or around. <laughs> oh, nice, Metsuri. Got on my game after a week without playing and Nate's gone. Yeah, see, that's the danger of it. <laughs> oh, Mermaid Cove, yes, yeah. We did a lot of diving earlier and it's thankfully it's not a really big encyclopedia. Also, did we talk to Cube yet? And recreate the <laughs> Yeah, random, I agree. I'd love to see them being tied to achievements and stuff in game. So when you've done X amount of things, you would you earn the right to use this public works project or item or whatever they want to call them. Uh, Reese, I'm not gonna lie, I don't recognize the name. Getting support for my petition, shoe tying instruction clinic, but I still need more. Si you don't wear shoes, Cube. I don't think I can do that today, buddy. Not today. I'm sorry, but I feel bad. I hate saying no to him. You have to get the flower from a tour. Yeah, I can do that pretty easily. Should try it. Oh, I just had the weirdest. <laughs> you know, I I mean, heck, even I don't wear shoes. I'm wearing socks right now. <laughs> I have my rainbow socks on. Memory is a, is a no-shoe kind of place. Where's flippers? Maybe I should also do save and continues for this. You know what, we can... We'll, we'll go shopping first, and then we'll head on over to the island, see if we can't get the mantis that I need, and then we'll head back. found one in the orchard next to the cherry tree. I did actually, Panda Lover. I think I got one. I'll go back and check because I know I found one in the orchard, but I don't know what tree it was next to. Uh, is it... Kyle, but missing your name, right? Welcome on in. Uh, I need it for completing the encyclopedia. Or the museum, essentially. I did, yeah. I did, um... Get the one next to the cherry tree. You're gonna go to memory and wear shoes? I should have a sign at the front. Like, when you get off the train saying, please remove your shoes. <laughs> Going to Disney World soon and I'm so excited. Oh, Christian, is it your first time? Or is it like a repeat visit? Because I've only been once and I'd love to go again. I love Disney very much. Fair warning, if you hear some weird noises coming from my mic. My upstairs neighbors are drilling something. Again. Ooh, do I have this? I don't know if I have it. Which would be very nice. <laughs> Trissy, no, we're trying to get the fly, I promise. I haven't snapped just yet. I swear to goodness you had that yesterday. What is going on? Ah, uh, the random Caden, thank you so very much for the follow. Loud noises, I'm sorry. My neighbors are just weird about drilling things at obnoxious times. The sign you need- no, random, it's a sign I don't. <laughs> it's so funny to hear when you speak. I'm sorry, I'm gonna be quiet if I hear it too much. <laughs> Neighbors were hammering something, thought the noises were over here. See? I could I maybe I could have got away without telling you guys, but um No, I'm good. They seem like some huge Pixar nut and they have Pixar Pier, yes, yes. Mmm, nothing 
there that I want. Nintendo Jock, hello, how's it going? Welcome on in. The arrow shirt, I had Colton wear it, not fun. Keep the arrow shirt. See what people, everyone wants that to be on Colton for some reason. Has Crystal put a drilling rig in town yet? Not yet. Keep drilling, she'll get our subtle hint. They always do it while I'm streaming too, like they're very consistent about it. It's a, a little bit obnoxious, okay. I'm kind of walking slow to see if I can spot any bugs we need on the trees. In particular that jewel beetle, but... Just caught the walking leaf. Does it literally just look like an item on the ground? Like an item leaf? Because I don't feel like I've seen one like at all yet. <laughs> there. It does? Okay. I remember seeing it a lot in my older towns, but not in this one for some reason. You're not what I need. Put in the thing to demolish the other bridge yet, yeah, by the way, I haven't. Maybe I should do that next. Um, actually, what order was it? If I set something to demolish first, can I set something to build right after that or something like that? Caden, maybe. Okay, you're not what I need. Uh, Jay Laval, thank you very much for that four months resub. Four months straight, thank you, thank you. It drops from the tree. Oh, does it actually come down from trees? I thought you could just find it on the ground. Oh, we just got a public works project suggestion. That's awesome. <laughs> that makes me happy. Citizen to demolish it takes a day before you can put anything up for a project. See, I've heard people tell me that I can have a demolish demolition project happening at the same time as a building project. Set up donations for a new public works project, then destroy a public works project, then pay off a new public works project. Okay, I'm gonna try that then. <laughs> It's a really good one for forest, is it? Let me go see. Also, let me just go check over here. Jewel beetle, nope. Nope, just lots of those guys. <laughs> Slightly different from the original, okay. When bridge on the town tree it looks so good yeah Andrew I, I love it I love it so much it's just it's pretty <laughs> it fits memory perfectly which by the way we have a ceremony for the wooden bridge project and I can't say to no I can't say no to Isabel like it's just it's you don't do that <laughs> so not going to Uh, you- you can see, am I saying your name right? Thank you very much for the follow. I- I still don't know if we're all supposed to be on this bridge. <laughs> Look at how short Gaston is. Look at how cute he is. Uh... Oh, Jay Lebel, not at all, not at all. You do what you gotta do, dude. Number Grand in Chow's 10, I think maybe I can't count properly. <laughs> Hi, Cat, how's it going? the bridge classes because too many people. <laughs> Hi Ark, how's it going dude? Uh, hooray for everyone! Let's get off this bridge you guys, we're all gonna drown. <laughs> oh, Eric is gonna pop that right into the back of my head. Does everyone see where Eric is? Wait for it, wait for it, watch him, watch him. Right in the back of my head. <laughs> it looks steadier than the exp it does, it does, you're right. Oh, Cat, hopefully we can, like, you know, help you chill out a little bit, for sure. Eric 
Eric, prepare your eardrums. <laughs> Why would you do that to me, Eric? Why is Bob being pushed across the bridge? Astrid, please. That's really funny, though. <laughs> I've never seen him, uh... Be so close behind... Or I've never seen a villager, I guess, be so close behind me. A my aggressive elk blows one's head with a bomber. <laughs> Is it true that the walking loop is easier to catch in the rain? Because that's what it says in the wiki. I have not heard that. For once, I want it to rain, then. I don't know how I feel about this one. It... I, yes, it would look good in a foresty setting, but memory is supposed to be fancy. I don't know. I've been different. <laughs> next, to, next to a bus station, I could see it. We don't have the bus station yet. Um... I heard people were upset about the bridge, so I just need to get over- Oh no, why do I read your comments random? The horror movie Streetlight? Yeah. Yeah, we're just gonna stick with Fairy Tale. This is what I'm gonna put down, by the way, because we took out another street lamp earlier. So, okay, so you guys said, put down a public works project, don't pay it off, go back and set to demolish something else, and then go pay it off. And it'll work. I'm trusting you guys. Ransom, <laughs> you quoted that. Okay. I love walking with Isabel. Look at how cute she is. I remember when I first saw the trailers for New Leaf, like very early on, and they showed Isabel following you. I imagined that she was going to follow you the entire time that you're playing, and I'm like, this is kind of awkward. <laughs> Okay, so the other fairy tale street light is going to be right here. You can actually see the little dirt spot where the old one was. What how she respects the path. <laughs> no worries, Ian, you enjoy your food. Perfect, that's exactly what I want. Uh yes. She's queen. <laughs> I wish that she would be like, do you want to come back to the town hall with me? So I'm going right back there right now anyway. Symmetry, yes. <laughs> and eventually we're going to remove this bench and replace it, I think, with the... I don't know the name of it. I always call it the white wood bridge. But I don't know. It's just a white bridge. Very, very pretty. Okay. Gaston has just like the most intense stare. He's really eyeing Astra down right now. Is it just called the wooden bench? Did I say bridge? Bench. I'm so sorry. Why haven't I joined the randoms yet? <sighs> the randoms are trying to take over. <laughs> I'm not gonna let them, but they're trying. He's mad because Bob got pushed over the bridge. Oh, he's trying to, like, avenge him. Oh, here we go. Okay. Okay, see? Awesome, thank you guys so much for letting me know. So we can demolish and build something at the same time. So we're getting rid of the suspension bridge. And I think, was that one there from the very beginning? Or was it not? Did we have a bridge in a different location first? <laughs> um, yes, that one. Uh, 
No, I'm pretty good. I need to squid. Hello, how are you doing today? So wooden or wood bench and it's an Uchi suggestion? I thought so. I assume so, knowing uh knowing Phoebe. Not beginning, beginning. Yeah, I I thought it I thought I heard it start raining in game. I was gonna lose it. I think I just heard this. I was like, no no, I know I said rain, but like not yet. I have to catch stuff. <laughs> Uh, I did, Benny, I did actually catch the scorpion the other day. It was awesome. Uh, I think we heard it first and we didn't see it. A little while later we saw it and I actually caught it right away, which was great. Um, I'm probably gonna end up putting up a, like, stream moments video, like, compilation sort of thing up on the YouTube channel and I'll, I'll be sure to include the tarantula and the scorpion catches in there. I just realized at Disney you would see Gaston. You will. You will. <laughs> oh, we're just below that. Okay, so we need... We need a couple more bells. Uh, Cruel World, we set to demolish a bridge and we also just put down the second fairy tale street. That's pretty much it, as far as I know. Um, alright. Let's nip over to the island now. Um, see if we can't get the mantis that I need. And have a song from Captain. Always, always good. <laughs> Real Sam, oh no. And of course, get a couple bells for, um, uh, for, um, the rest of that public works project. Uh, Spartan, hello! How are you doing today? I love those cute emotes. I'm from Captain, never go wrong. <laughs> you know what? It's quite warm in here. But honestly, I kind of feel like I'm getting used to it. It's actually not that bad. I'm surviving. Now that I've said that, I'm going to start sweltering, but... Uh, Abby, thank you very much for the follow. Flame, hello! Welcome back. How are you doing? I love when you go from like a rainy, cloudy day in your town to the island, which is always sunny, and you can see the clouds separating and the rain stopping, and I love it. I have lunch delayed, Braid. It's okay. How are you doing, though, dude? Hope you're having a good day. You know what? The jewel beetle is also occasionally on the island, but I think it might only be on normal trees, not palm trees, maybe? Dagger, yeah, I have. Um, there is a fellow streamer by the name of DIY Crossing who I really enjoy lurking <laughs> uh, on her streams, and she makes almost like custom amiibo figures um, by hand. It's very interesting to watch her, her make them. But um, I've, I've had a really strong temptation for a while now to commission and ask for her to make my cat Tiger as an amiibo or as an Animal Crossing villager. It's been tempting, but I'm, I'm a little bit shy. <laughs> yeah, cool, well, unfortunately. Um, okay. Oh wait, no, I need, I need a flower, don't I? What's your favorite fruit? I like watermelon. I love watermelon as well. Um, I'd probably say watermelon, honestly, followed by strawberries, maybe. Tiger amoeba. <laughs> okay, let's see what tours we have. We might be able to find a white flower in one of them. Uh, hide and seek, dragonfly, labyrinth. Free diving, seafood, lots of diving. Gross. Uh, let's do an easy hide and seek tour and see if I can't find what I'm looking for. I like blueberries. I like blueberries in things. I don't like blueberries by themselves. I'm very picky. I want to make a new figure the way she does. She's so incredibly talented. And she seems like a lovely person. I'm just incredibly shy. <laughs>
I didn't see arcs like I'm ready. <laughs> Logan, yes, what do you have to tell me? Munching on your snack of pepper. Oh no. Pepper, it'll be fine, I promise. Only like watermelon flavored things. Really, wa real watermelon isn't good to eat. I'm the exact opposite. I don't like watermelon flavored things, but I like actual watermelon. Ooh, Logan, do you mean that in like a drink format or. Okay, also, guys, keep an eye out for villagers, but also keep an eye out for a white flower. <laughs> Or maybe I should bring back multiple white flowers? Would that help? I also- I always forget that you can, like, run. A oh, white flower. I see a white flower. Cool. Oh, and, like, food format. Okay. And seek is your favorite? I'm really bad at hide and seek, so... This is a beginner tour. I'm probably gonna fail. <laughs> I haven't found anyone so far. You could catch bugs here. I probably could if I talked to Lloyd, but uh, I'm gonna see if they even like. I don't know if the jewel beetle will spawn here. If you know what I mean. Did I see someone back there? No, that was a butterfly. <laughs> oh, hi, friend. Who are you, Bettina? Yes. Uh, Mermaid Cove, it's DIY Crossing. DIY Crossing. Uh, no one here. Health or <laughs> pepper, you're a healthy snack. Love that. New white flowers walks by some white roses. I mean, technically, I already have four. I think I'm okay. Now I just need the villagers. Oh, not at all, not at all. Uh, ooh, hi. Uh, Derwin? Wilson, my apologies. Uh, ooh, can't see your face. Opal? No. Oh, no, completely wrong. <laughs> Going off with the color of your legs, friend, I'm sorry. Um. Oh, well, there's a bridge down, of course. Sandra, uh, hello, how's it going? We put a lighthouse so far away from the beach. I like the randomly generated, like, towns, if you know what I mean. Uh, no one there. No one there. I can't find this last villager, I swear to goodness, you guys. Oh, is that O'Hare? It's O'Hare. Love O'Hare. <laughs> He's a good bun bun. Ark would have found them all by now. I see you, Pepper, judging. <laughs> oh, I do need to go to guest songs in 15 minutes. You're absolutely correct. Rose is knowing her house is in a terrible position. She literally spends all day in... Appleton Main Street, like, come on, leave already, go home, your fish are worried about you. Okay. So, we got a couple white flowers. Um, let's go ahead and put those down and I guess just wander around and hope that something spawns on them? Like, fingers crossed we can do this? Should I plant them all together, maybe? I guess. I guess I need a bug net now, don't I? Mm, okay, grab that. And, alright, cool. Find you, Cool. We're trying to catch a um, orchid mantis, I believe it's pronounced. If I need you. 
don't think I do. Either way, it's too late now. <laughs> Wait. Do I need you? Migratory locust. I did not. Okay. How about you? Do I need you? No worries, Katie. Grasshopper, we didn't need. Didn't- I, I assume I didn't need that either. Go on, go away. I'm not used to- I'm still not used to- Do I need that? That's not the one I need, but... Do I need you? No. At least we know something will spawn there. <laughs> Found the last fossil? It's in a mean placement. Uh, where is it? Where is it? Ooh. No. There we go. <laughs> uh, Melanie's back. Hello, how are you doing today? Welcome on in. Hope you're having a good day today. Hope your week has been good thus far. Hidden behind the bush next to Colton's. Oh, gosh darn. I figured it was going to be behind a bush. It just kind of seems like... Excuse you. There we go. <laughs> Place it would go. Andrew, yes! I, 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 I want to go back and count how many times I swung my net. Oh, look! It's what I needed last stream. Honestly, by the way, I'm just trying to catch these things. Partially to get the other to spawn in, but also because... Um, I can sell them. And make uh, and make some bells to finish paying off that street light. Finally found a good map for your new town. Very nice. Gonna have Blanche. Don't have a lot. Blanche is very very cute. Oh gosh, there's like a party going on over here. Money, money, money. <laughs> There it is, there it is, there it is. Heck yeah, there we go. That one, super annoying to catch. <laughs> um, because it does only spawn on the white flowers, so. Um, if you have a town full of flowers, it can be a little bit annoying to find it. There we go, awesome. Panic. <laughs> 50 swings minimum, yeah, there was a lot of swinging happening. I didn't scare it away, thank goodness. <laughs> Actually, it scares it away. Considering how fast it spawned there, I'm not... I, it would have been fine. Alright, and we get to head back in enough time to see Gaston, which is great. Now tell the mantis by accident. <laughs> or let it go by accident. Or have Gaston scared away from me by accident, yep. By accident, by the way, for that Gaston one. Kill the flowers later. Later. I'll, I'll be back. <laughs> no worries, sometimes I don't even know. We'll see you in a minute in a little bit. Jill Val, that's totally fine. That's totally fine. Just as I was telling you earlier. When will Grace start appearing in your town? Uh, what level of Timmy and Tommy's store do you have right now? Um, you need to be up to... Is it Super TNT or TIY? I've forgotten. Uh, and then spend a certain amount of bells in their shop and then she'll start appearing, I think? Chris has a nice orchid man to have there. Like, no. <laughs> I'll say no to them. Arcade Kelly, hello! How you doing? Was it TIY? So you just continue spending in their store and eventually she will spawn. I think she only spawns once every week, but it's a random day each time, I believe. Even Bob, even Bob, even Bob. We have goals here. We have goals. Bob, Bob can understand. Oh good, it's not raining. Actual Cranston, a dreamy. Gladys, class is very cute. Bella and Tom, very nice. Um, there we go. Give me 
a second here. Let me put this down. Your wellness, that's totally fine. So I've been looking everywhere for you. I need an orchid mantis shock. You have one. Can you trade it for a piece of paper? <laughs> no one my villagers, honestly. I like my villagers. Alright, let's run up to the museum. Oh, but actually... Uh, bush behind- beside Colton's house, you were saying, right? Is it hiding? Oh, yes. Yep. That is an evil place. Thank you so much for helping me find that. <laughs> Poor source of Gracie never showing up, so I'm dreading the upgrade. Yeah, she- she's very, very, um, weird about the days that she will come over. Mighty Owl, hello, welcome back. Amelia and Midge just starters. Oh my goodness, Dagger, those are like my beginning Animal Crossing GameCube villagers. <laughs> Any luck with this? No. Like this Blanche? I'm not sure, actually. I always assumed she was normal, but I could be wrong. Sneaky fossil. <laughs> How do you see that? Exactly, like, how would you be supposed to see that? I gotta put some flowers back there or something, because that is impossible to spot. Okay, Blathers, let's go ahead and donate this before I accidentally sell it or release it or do something silly, knowing me. I apparently clicked on assess fossils just out of habit. <laughs> okay, make a donation. There we go. Thankfully, I don't have to worry about that one anymore. So now all we need is the walking leaf, ladybug, jewel beetle, which I'm not looking forward to, and the fly. <laughs> oh, is Blanche actually snooty? Really? I didn't think she would be. Interesting. There we go. Ladybugs are quite common. You know what? The funny thing is, I saw a lot of ladybugs before I decided to start working on the museum. And then after I started, after I decided that I'm gonna like finish it in time for March, I didn't see any more. <laughs> Covered really rare fish and accidentally let it go. Oh no. <laughs> Walking leaf is cool. It is a very neat uh, little bug for sure. Murphy's Law for you. 100%. Yeah. No, the game knows. It's like, oh yeah, you know, you're not finishing this. <laughs> you're not allowed to leave. <laughs> Stream 35. Oh my goodness. And right for sure. Welcome on in. Um, I forget what episode this is gonna be. I think it's like 80 something and that's crazy to think about that there's been that many streams. <laughs> but I hope you're having a great day. Welcome on in. Let's see if this is enough to pay off the rest of that uh, public works project. It is, awesome. Now 325, go to Gaston's, will do. Robin is- Robin is a good burp. Midge is best burp. In my opinion. But Robin is very, very good burp. Okay, I'm assuming Gaston's probably gonna be in there early. He is. Let's go say hello. Two minutes late for Gaston. Maybe I'm two minutes late. I'm five minutes early. It's so good to see you. Come on in already. So he, he asked for the tarantula when we caught a spare one the other day, so. But Gaston wants, Gaston gets. It may look like this now, but I tried to clean up a little, or sorry, it may look like this now, but I tried to clean up a little before you came. What? Oh, is that a mosquito? I was trying to figure out what was in there. <laughs> I think I'm gonna take this shirt from him. 
This house is wrecked? It is. It is a little bit. <laughs> he also has spooky music in here. Studying away, I think, through us is plenty for today, but I got my spots planned perfectly, so I'm going. Just going for your dreamies, best of luck. Best of luck, that's awesome. You know what? Um, Andrew, I always assumed that was not an open hole. I thought it was just like a window to look in and you could open it up and reach in if you wanted to. Uh, Oak Tree Crossing, thank you very much for the follow. Welcome on in. How do you imagine Random living if he lived alone? Ladybugs found March, April, May, June, and October. Oh, really? See, my thing... Oh, does it say March through June? Why says March through to July for some reason? Maybe I miswrote that. Oh, well. Maybe that's why I've, I stopped seeing them. I'll see you again in October, then. There are breather holes on the sides. You're correct. You're correct. The mosquito probably could go through there. I hate how the tarantula is just consistently walking. That bothers me. I'm gonna leave. Hey, Hi, Finn. How's it going? Welcome back. Uh, Kitty, hello. Hey, Kitty, hey, Dirty. I guess Gaston, Gaston himself. Amazing villager. His house on the outside, actually pretty nice. His house on the inside, scary. <laughs> um, cool. All right. Gonna keep my net out just in case. Why? No such luck yet. Maybe we should be saving and continuing in front of those? Does anyone know how long it will take a fly to spawn? I have some music to put away that I keep forgetting about. Oh, this one's actually cute. I don't mind this one. But cruising is the favorite one. You know, Epic Joy, I don't think I've ever had that happen. I don't know. Maybe I haven't waited around long enough. Get stale cupcakes again on Saturday. Uh, to get inside a villager's house in New Heisen, would you keep Gaston's house creepy? I definitely would make it creepy, but I wouldn't make it so we're dilapidated like it is. I'd make it a bit nicer. It's just very dark. Spawn pretty often, but maybe your ornaments might make them not spawn. See, that's what I was thinking, but people were telling me, so long as I have trash, flies will spawn. But maybe I'm wrong? Anyway, I'm gonna kind of keep an eye out on the trees here and see if I can't get the jewel beetle, because that's the next one that I'm kind of concerned about. Uh, as well as the walking leaf, but otherwise, they'll spawn regardless of ornaments. But they were like the ants. I mean, the ants did spawn uh, the other day, so that was good. Uh, Amy Lou, I've been pretty good. It's been a very, it's been a very hot day for me, unfortunately. Um, air conditioner broke down or is not working. <laughs> Right now. Never really used it? Yeah. No, I always have it on. Um, but I've I don't think I've really bothered getting these ones before. Right, right, hello. You enjoy your lurk. Oh wait, I can actually pay off this now. I didn't even get candy. Um, so you can get it during the month of October from the store. But we got ours from uh the Bunny Day event. Uh some of the prizes I think include candy in them or something, so I have like a whole stash of it. Ah, oh, Pepper, apparently I did. Found on spoiled items, yes. <laughs> Eating pasta over here, very nice. I had pasta for lunch, it was amazing. Sting, hello, how are you doing today? Did I say walking stick, by the way? Walking leaf, I'm sorry. Is that even the name of it? Sounds like such a weird name for some reason. 
I always expect it to spawn on these trees here where I won't be able to see it too easily. Oh, nice pepper. Do I time travel? Not really. I time travel occasionally for stream purposes. For example, if I want to see KK's show on... That butterfly is stuck in Astrid's house. Anyone else seeing that? <laughs> it is legitimately stuck in Astrid's house. Um... But yeah, sorry to answer your question. I wonder if it'll move if I get closer to it. What are you doing there, friend? Oh, there we go. There we go. Um, I'm not gonna bother catching it. <laughs> it deserves to be free. Um, I I only really time travel for streams. Usually, if I'm not like recording or streaming, I generally don't time travel if I can avoid it. Apparently Astrid's house is sticky for some reason. I probably don't want to know why. I don't know how to pronounce that word, Charisma, but yeah, that, that, that flower I know will also spawn that stuff, but we're, we have no chance of getting that in this town. Not without some serious <laughs> destruction. I'm so upset because I've seen that drill bug a couple times, but I just I've always scared it away by accident. For her peach collection. <laughs> Used to time travel a lot, then he stopped. Yeah. I uh I never really did too too much. For for movie and villagers occasionally and for streams, yes, but otherwise not really. When I boot can tire outside their house for two days and saw nothing but spoiled fruit and turnips will allow them to spawn. Okay. I don't think it'll spawn on these types of trees, but I could be wrong. See, and then here's another area where I wouldn't want it to spawn because it's so annoying to see all these. Well, we gotta bye bye Butterfree. <laughs> no. No, that's too emotional, you guys. Oh. I didn't mean to click on it. Who is in the camper? Uh, Twiggy, I think? Uh, is it- is it Jesse? Welcome on in, thank you so very much, I'm glad you like it. Nothing. Sorry for the constant flipping up of cameras, I'm looking at the logs on the, uh... For the... Log part of the tree. <laughs> Awesome, hello, it's going pretty good. How about you? Caught a couple bugs today. Uh, we had a very generous raid from Hylie, and it's just it's been a very chill day. Oh no, Epic Joy, I'm I'm not just looking for the um for the walking leaf, I'm also looking for the jewel beetle. Jewel beetle as well, which will be on the uh on the tree stumps or tree logs. That doesn't sound right. What what word am I thinking of? Trunks, there we go, thank you. It's blanking so hardcore on a very simple word. <laughs> Tree logs does not sound right. <laughs> Gaston up there with his watering can. Pretending he's not helping memory. I think he stumps too and it did not sound right. Yeah, it was just like, that's not what it's meant to sound like. Okay, come on game. That is not the jewel beetle, that's a fruit bug. Or fruit beetle or whatever they're called. I did, I did get the orchid mantis thankfully. There. Okay, maybe I should do some saving continues and see if I can't get it to spawn on the garbage. I know I've been told it'll spawn on garbage or it'll spawn on uh, the rotten fruit and stuff like that, but... Area below Mike's house? Not really. I've had, a, I've had an idea to put 
uh, one of the windmills there or put a windmill there, but I don't think I'm going to. Like Wild World, very nice. Are you playing it on the DS, on the Wii U Virtual Console? <laughs> Ark. Drilling rig near Mike's? No, we're not doing the drill and rig. <laughs> If we do the drilling rig, assume I have lost my mind. See, I kind of... I know I've heard at least that it'll spawn over trash. I gave you last night for dinner, but if you for lunch, send help. I'm a bad influence, I'm gonna go say do it. <laughs> but I'm just a bad influence, don't listen to me. Whistle smiles, hello, how are you doing today? Colton, you're just like, what are you doing? Why is there trash on the floor? This does not happen in memory. Ah, uh, Ruby. Hello, how are you doing today? Welcome on in. Oh, no, that's not what I need. That's a fruit beetle again. A fruit bug, whatever it is. Can we for new horizons? Yes. It's a long time coming. <laughs> Is it stable perfect town? No, but I've been told it won't matter. Uh, just like how we got the ant. Uh, on Saturday, even if you have perfect town, they can still spawn. Apparently. No, I'm trying to see that tree trunk gastro- okay. <laughs> there we go. Oh, I swear to goodness, you scared away with your shovel. <laughs> Bugs make the weirdest noise. The cicadas, you mean? Yeah, whistle smells. I didn't either. To be honest, I would have thought I would have had to do it, but I really didn't want to do that. Hey, for the new puns when catching fish and bugs. <laughs> Pasta, but I don't have any marinara sauce or shredded parmesan, so obviously KFC is the next best thing. I mean, you know what? I've had some bad experiences with KFC, but I still appreciate it for what it is. I love chicken, <laughs> so. Do I need that? I probably don't need that. I don't think I need any more dragonflies that I can catch right now, at least. Oh gosh, I remember this username. Uh. It wasn't pronounced the way I thought it was pronounced, was it? <laughs> was it it's Shiloh? Shiloh now? Am I saying that right? I'm not saying it right. I'm so sorry. Welcome on in. Thank you so much for the host. Sh I remember the name. I remember it very clearly. <laughs> Popeyes is better. I've had Popeyes. I enjoy it. I enjoy it. Um, I wouldn't even, like, they're both fried chicken almost, but like, I wouldn't pair them together or like, compare them in my eyes. They're very different, if you know what I mean. Never had KFC. <laughs> very, very greasy. No beetles, no nothing. Okay, that's there. Silo Nano. Oh, see, I remember, I remember it. I remember having trouble with it a, a, a while ago, but welcome back. Thank you so much for the host. I'm sorry about that. Uh, nope. Astra, could you please get something to spawn? <laughs> like she has control over it. I'm just like, feed me. Some of the competitions are about food. Oh no, Clavrance. <laughs> Oh, I feel bad. I remember when I used to uh, record visiting viewer dream towns, I would always get hungry midway through recording. And that used to be whenever, or it seemed like whenever I got hungry is when all the towns, the really nice kitchens came up. Burn on her arm from taking out a tray of chicken. Oh my goodness. It's not so nice. Thank you. 
just how it goes up and down. It is very satisfying. It looks very nice as well. Start it. What am I looking for on the trash? Uh, a fly. Looking for the fly. Maybe you're getting ready theme. Um, I have it listed on the um getting ready screen. It's like early, early in the neighborhood or something like that. I forget. I mean, I'm gonna switch over really quickly. It's gonna look weird for a second, but easy in the neighborhood five by Johan Heinian. I don't, I don't know how to say that. <laughs> there we go. Hey Brandon, not at all. How are you doing today? I want to spawn on rotten fruit and candy. See, I had ants spawn on candy, but not flies. Ooh, Zach, do you know what you're having for dinner then? During second shift at KFC, and they wouldn't let him get a plaster. When he got home, he sent me a pick of the blisters. Oh my goodness, no. <laughs> That's not nice. Misguided him. Well, if you guys are saying that they'll spawn on candy, I can try that too. A lot of different information going around, so I'm not really sure what to believe anymore. But oh, that's a B. Okay. Don't check out in your garden. Surely it would attract male flies. <laughs> uh, Gilio? Gilio? Teprod? I'm not sure if I'm saying that right. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome on in. I think I'm mispronouncing it. I hope you're having a good day though. Uh, Jesse, I used a method called path plot resetting. I believe if you type in exclamation mark path plot resetting, I believe. <laughs> uh, I do have a guide on how to do it. Nothing there. Finally got the scorpion. Only need 12 bugs. Very nice. Oh, well, we'll some. Hopefully you have something good for dinner. Oh, cruel world. <laughs> Put a piece of candy. I've done it and gotten one. Great essays for my teacher. It was like this. Oh, no. Oh, Elliot! I completely mispronounced. Oh my goodness. Elliot, welcome on in. <laughs> Just don't put the spaces. For sure, no worries. Welcome on in, Elliot. I'm so sorry about that. I was just like, Elio. <laughs> nope, that's not right at all. Oh, let me go ahead and sell all this stuff, actually. There we go, plot resetting. I always forget what my own command is. Candy might just attract more ants. I'm willing to try it, honestly, but I really just want the fly game. Well, Elliot, thank you so very much for coming on over to the uh, to the Twitch channel. I hope you enjoy it. And uh, Jesse, thank you very much for the follow as well. Uh, Nintendo Modder, thank you so very much for the host. Went birthday shopping and I got a pride shirt and a pronoun sticker. Very cool. Very cool. I kind of want to make it my goal to check out Toronto's Pride Parade one time, but I'm a little bit nervous of the crowds because I, I know it, it draws in a very, very large number of people. I'll just put one of everything outside and hope for the best. <laughs> Probably do the same for flowers. Marshall, I can definitely see them doing it. Um, purely because of the amount of items I think we're gonna have to pick up um, for like crafting and stuff. I, I can't imagine that we won't be able to stack. Off of a rotten turnip, Zelda God? Yeah. I, um, I have a turnip, but unfortunately it's not rotten yet and I don't know if I really want to time travel for that. No worries, Cruel World. Nope, still nothing there. Bob, you better have not caught it. <laughs> I 
We're head to toe rainbows. I need that in my life, Pepper. But it has a huge parade. Oh my god. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and I, I always see it on TV and it looks amazing and stuff like that. And I'd love to check it out and, and support and stuff like that. But crowds, man. <laughs> People scare me. Oh, is that crossing? That actually sounds really yummy. Really move your clock back a minute and it rots, does it? Really? I'm willing to give that a try. Okay. Well, first off, you know what? Let me let me go put out some candy as well. Let's just definitively figure this out. <laughs> um. Okay. So I put it in here, and I also have candy. Secret storage candy. There's one. Uh, completely missed out on some bugs that are only available in April and May. Yeah, no, I, I, um, I almost ran into the same issue. I, thankfully, I think I'm only missing maybe one thing, and I'm hoping I can, like, visit someone else's town who's time-traveled back or forward. Um... I'm just gonna have, like, a section of, <laughs> of stuff. That one candy the ants have been on already, it's true! This is trash pile. <laughs> Okay. I'm gonna try time traveling back a minute. <laughs> and we'll see if it does anything. Did you may hello have to plot reset and I don't feel like it by the way. I'm used to be used to tea cakes, but you change it. Okay, no worries, no worries. I hope you uh, get your plot resetting done whenever you do feel like it. Go back an hour to be safe. Gosh, I hate time traveling. <laughs> I hate it so much. And before anyone tells me, I know you can time travel from within the game, but I never ever do. I time travel from here. It just makes me more comfortable. I'm not sure why. It's only an hour. Don't worry, girl. And before I come back and everything's on fire. <laughs> Thank you, Nintendo Modder. Um, date and time. Current time. Okay, so a bit of an hour backwards. An hour backwards. Mmm, I don't like this. Ah, <laughs> oh, May Rendon, thank you. I hope we can as well. Um, I really, really want to get this done before March and just- or before March 19th, I guess. Okay. Things are on fire in complete chaos. Yes, Red Arrow, yes, that one. Is that from the show Community? I think? Why are we time traveling? We're trying to get an ant or, or, sorry, not an ant, a fly to spawn on some stuff. We're seeing if this is gonna rot a turnip I have out. Imagine the fly being the last bug you need. At the very least, the fly's available at any time, I think. And now there's be different. <laughs> All right, let's see. Did it did it rot or not? I'm assuming it did. Aha! There's 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 still no fly though. Save and continues. Edge everything I need before March twentieth too. It's making me a bit stressed. I made a like a Google Doc with all of my um, things in it that I need to catch from each like category, and it really helped me kind of like even out. Okay, I can catch things during this time, this time. Game, please, please love me. <laughs> Everyone moves out. If 
five flies in my room yesterday and one can't spawn in a whole town? <laughs> Apparently not. We're gonna start walking around scaring away the other bugs. Thank you. Fly, where are you? Oh, Kevin, hi, buddy. Look, my personality's gone all soft and flabby on me lately. Uh, greeting. What is your current greeting, Kevin? Like, <laughs> uh, so we don't have a tips greeting for him yet. If you guys are new here, it's an ongoing gag that my villagers' greetings be tips something. So I think Kevin, or sorry, Eric, the deer is currently tips antlers. Tips pork, tips bacon, and tips ham. I love your, I love your guys' thought process. <laughs> it's bacon is too dark. I mean, there's a villager called Rasher. Come on. <laughs> Tips chops. <laughs> I'm seeing a lot of tips bacon. Tips Kevin bacon. <gasps> oh, there's not enough room for that, but if there was, I would. There isn't enough room. No, <laughs> Baco. We're gonna do tits bacon. I, there's a lot of tits bacon in the chat. Why does that look like it's... Bacon doesn't look like a word to me right now for some reason. It's footloose. <laughs> Kevin Bacon. Why the tips? Um, I think it started with spilling- like the whole spilling the tea thing, as the young young kids say these days about like giving the gossip, I guess. <laughs> and then I think it turned into Tip's, Tip's hat or something for Colton because he's kind of a weird guy and then it turns into Tip's wig because we make the joke that his hair isn't real and then it just, everyone tips something. Bacon doesn't look like a real word to me right now. Tip's bacon. <laughs> Go away. You're not the one I want. Loki also still looking for that jewel beetle. Best tree flower combo is cedars and orange pansies for sure. I think I know- I always get pansies confused with other ones, but I think I know what you're talking about and I can agree, that would actually look quite nice. Usually see them on the island. Yeah, I've seen I think two in my town recently, and I scared both away, unfortunately. But they also do spawn on the island. Uh, just lurk now and work on my drawing. No worries, you enjoy that. Best of luck with your drawing, whatever, whatever it is you're working on. Okay, I'm just gonna. There's our first balloon of the stream. That actually took a while. Elliot, I did, I did. I don't really play Pocket Camp very much, but uh, the items look really, really cute. Oh, is there a fly in there? <laughs> okay, there we go. Scared away a lot of bugs. Come on, game. Is that what I need? No, that's the stink bug again. Oh, well, okay, there's a fly here, and there's ants on the turnip. <laughs> so confirmed, I have beautiful town ordinance on. It can spawn on garbage, and ants can also spawn on the turnip. <laughs> All confirmed at once. There we go. There we go. That, that one was the one I was a little bit worried about, was the fly, because it's just... You have to have something on the ground for it, which I don't like. <laughs> 
It just wanted me to have the turnip, <laughs> obviously. No worries, Foxfire. We'll see you later. Now we have to wash our hands. <laughs> Oh, whoops. Oh, Kenarai? Yeah, I... I've actually had that comment a lot. It might have been because the hairstyle she was using is one that I commonly use in New Leaf, maybe? Not using it right now, of course, but... People remaking the Sanrio cards as keychains. Oh, that's cute. Okay, so... One thing I need now... Jewel bug, apparently not the ladybug, and the walking leaf. I'm happy with magic caps though. The, the fly and the and the orchid mantis are two that I really wasn't looking forward to, so. And I have yours, I'll give you a trash can for it. Look at how cute its little icon is. Oh my god. The eyes. <laughs> Why are you adorable? Get out. You picky thing. Mom, thank you so very much for that five month resub. Welcome back. How are you doing today? Love and chat, you guys. My goodness. It's goddamn. I love your use of the shook emote. I need to add that to my thing as well because I. Oh, Ark did an amazing job. Okay, there we go. Cool. I'm happy we finally caught that. Walking leaf, though. I don't know. I haven't even seen it yet. Do one of the areas of my town, and I forgot to put designs on the ground. Oh no, and Bunny keeps trying to put her house there. Isn't that frustrating? I've had that happen far too many times where you just forget one little area. It's a hiding leaf. <laughs> Apparently it is. Walking leaf. Misha's new emote is very, very cute. Oh, that's not what I want. Oh. Of course. What, what would happen here? There's a fly on the turnip. But there's also ants on the turnip. If I was to swing my net right now, which one would I catch first? And would it scare the other one away, or would I technically catch both? What would happen here, you guys? Hypothetically. Oh no, can I? <laughs> I caught the fly first, and the ants are still on it. Animal Crossing science here, you guys. <laughs> Animal Crossing science. So whatever is higher up, maybe? Interesting. <laughs> okay. Well, you know what? I'm gonna keep that rotten turnip and that piece of candy in my inventory, just in case there's anyone else who might need it in the future so that I can give back as well, because someone, obviously, a stick did help me with the garbage, so. Ants are stronger than flies, confirmed. <laughs> uh, whoops, no, I want to put it in my secret storage. Another game? Yeah, for sure. Are you on the Discord? If you want, you can message me post-stream and I can see about getting that to you. I have a lot of <laughs> candy in here. Waited for you to suffer all stream and then said, here's both at the same time. Yep. Yep. It is what it is. <laughs> Nintendo's law, whatever is highest must be caught first. Do you have a flea? Who has a flea? Bob. Cookie, you can call me Cookie if you want. Is that Kevin? Kevin? Stop it. Why do you have a flea? <laughs> Could I have that trash? Uh, oh. Right, I forgot that he wants to talk to me after I catch it. <laughs> there we go. My villagers, for whatever reason, they're just- they're a dirty bunch. Always have some sort of flea going on. 
I also love the fact that you catch one flea, whereas usually it's like an infestation, like uh, Dagger just said, and we only catch one. <laughs> oh, Rain Fairy, best of luck. Congrats on paying off the second, second level there. Start tipping baths instead of bacon. Have the flea king, the rest run away. Okay, so walking leaf. Some people have said that it does fall down from trees, and others were saying you just find it on the ground. Is it a case of it could be either or? Because I want to try looking for that next, while I'm also keeping an eye for the jewel beetle. That's why they're so dirty, you only catch one, the others stay. We actually don't have a lot of just like empty trees in memory, that's the other thing. You've only ever seen it already on the ground, you catch. <laughs> Both, I think. Walking leaves are usually on the floor. Doesn't fall out of trees. I've only seen the walking leaf on the ground. It spawns next to trees. Okay. In other words, given some trees the stink eye right now, trying to catch two different things on them or around them. Both. It could be either, because I don't want to be shaking trees. And getting stung, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not too interested in that. The issue is I have a lot of trees like this where they're kind of staggered, and I can't see what's behind them. Uh... I follow the tree when you shake it or just sitting beside it. So maybe if I just, like, walk into it... Nothing there, nothing there, nothing there. At least in city folk, you have to shake the tree. Would walking into it, maybe, be enough? I'm so worried it's gonna spawn in here. Like, this is the worst place ever. The spawning animation is falling. Okay. Okay, just wanna make sure. And these ones, nothing there. Okay, scare what I don't need away. Spamming, you'll catch the bee. And here I am, just like repeatedly doing that. <laughs> Padfoot, hello, how are you doing? What movie did you go see? I hope you enjoyed whatever it was. Guys, I'm so looking forward to The Lion King. I don't know about you guys, but like that's kind of like, gonna be like the highlight of my summer in terms of movies. Um, randomly find them on the ground. Okay, ten days to go. Yeah. Um, and then this weekend, Mike and I are both really excited because Dragon Quest Builders Two is coming out. We're gonna play that game together. Uh, oh, pretty butterfly. Uh, what games are you guys currently looking forward to? Or movies? What in media are you guys currently interested in? Uh, Tony, by the way, hello. Only seen the walking leaf on the ground beside trees. You'll notice it move when you go near it. Uh, Seafolk Crossing, thank you very much for the follow. Did you feel a good movie? I cry a little. <laughs> So ready for the Lion King, it's my absolute favorite movie ever. Yeah, I love I love I love Disney's The Lion King. Oh, whistle smells. It sounds like someone missed you. <laughs> New Spider-Man random, yeah. Dragon Builders for sure. Yeah, it's so so fun. I love the first one. Uh Mike hasn't played the first one, but he has seen me play a lot of it, and he's like, that looks cool. And then the second one comes out and they announce multiplayer, and we're like, okay, yeah, we're both pre-ordering that. <laughs> Second balloon for today. BBIRL, hello! Here it works, I'll be lurking, no worries. I hope you're having a good day. Uh, 
Uh, Safe Crossing, I've been watching your videos on YouTube since memories began, but I finally decided to make a Twitch. But welcome on over. I hope you enjoy Twitch. It's a really fun platform. Um, and thank you so much for checking out the streams live. Which do you like better, spaghetti or good old fashioned mac and cheese? Mac and cheese all the way. For Mario Maker 2, yeah, Mike and I, uh, actually, I, sorry, I got that, um, a couple of days ago now, I used the Nintendo voucher thing, if you know, where you can get two games for a slightly reduced price. So I pre-ordered Dragon Quest Builders with it, and I also got, um, uh, Super Mario Maker 2. <laughs> I'm super proud about pizza, why must you do this to me? Oh no. Green Fairy. Thank you so very much. I'm gonna need the luck. Thank you so much for the biddies. It's time for the Breath of the Wild sequel. Yes. Yes. That, uh, that trailer, like that just short, very short trailer they showed us, uh, provoked me to restart Breath of the Wild and finally 100%, well not 100%, but like finally complete it. Uh, cause I never have. I don't think this bug wants me, you guys. <laughs> How much do you say? Because in Canadian it's like 120 and that kind of bums you out. I forget. I think it depends on which games you get because I don't think they're all the same price. Um, but I think Dragon Quest Builders Canadian. I feel like it was 80. 80 Canadian. And then on top of that, a second game um, would have come out to like. I don't know if it's 80 actually. It might be 60. I feel like it came out to higher than the amount, obviously. I wouldn't have used it otherwise. Breath of the Wild going for you. It's good. I've been taking my time. I've just been kind of going through and trying to find all the shrines in each region before really doing too much. Do you suck playing Zelda games? I'm not very good at them either, but I really enjoy them. Ah, uh, Padfoot, we put down and funded a fairy tale street leg. We set the demolition for this bridge so we can place it with a different bridge. Um, we've caught a whole cup like a couple bugs for our encyclopedia and we also just did dailies and stuff like that. August through to September 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. Walking leaf. Yeah. Mine says July through to September but it's probably better in August so maybe I could wait for that one. I'm hoping I can just like find it during stream randomly. <laughs> Snap Breath of the Wild two months after the sequel was announced. Oh my goodness. Or before. Before, sorry, the sequel was announced. Okay, anyway. Let's go take a break and see what Harvey's up to. Caught a fly after 3,000 years? Yes, we did. It took us a little while, but we did it. Back to the prices in USD, so with the conversion, it's really pricey for me. It's really look at the games on there and see, you know, the games that are applicable to you, because it's not for every single game, obviously. Um, and see how much the two of them would be the two that you want together, really. That's what I ended up doing, and it did come out to be worth it. Uh, oh, you are so cute! Oh my god! Oh, no, no, I. Oh. Oh, I didn't mean to. Harvey, you have a friend on your head. Oh, Wind Waker hurts your eyes? I love Wind Waker. Oh my god, Chip. You have such a cute little RV. Just all the time, if only he could catch a single fish, nevertheless, Chip loves the great outdoors and visits as many campgrounds as he can. That's adorable. No, Rathapu, you no, know, it's it's for select select ones. It's like, I guess, I don't know if you call it their AAA ones, but like, certain more expensive games. No worries, Hagenite. Thank you so much for hanging out with us today. 
He's adorable, isn't he? Ooh, seafoot crossing. Um, not sure where you are exactly. Is that something I need? No. Um, but I know where I am. It's very hard to find amiibo in physical stores. So honestly, Amazon or eBay are probably your best bet, especially if you're going for a specific one. <laughs> Good news. That's perfect. That's actually perfect. Um, no, not there. Elvis, thank you very much for that prime year long sub love in chat, you guys. Love in chat. <laughs> fish isn't- or this fish, my goodness, this bug does not want me to find it. And I don't think there's any deep sea creatures or fish that I can even catch right now. I think I've caught all the ones that I can for this current, like, season. We also haven't seen a- yeah, I think we've seen the jeweled beetle today, but like a while ago. Uh, and- en en Enamori? Am I saying your name right? Welcome on in. I'm sorry if I'm not. Don't need you. Uh, Shani Yelly, hello! I'm gonna be lurking to play my time at Porsche. Oh my goodness, yes! I restarted my time at Porsche just the other day, actually. Someone brought it up on Twitter saying that I should play it on the channel, and I'm like, I should! <laughs> I'm gonna go back and replay it off stream again and think about how I would include it into the streams. Uh, Elvis, I didn't, I didn't. That's another one of the, uh, the phone games, isn't it? Mm, okay. Not getting very lucky here. <laughs> That's really weird to see two villagers fishing like that really close together. Oh, uh, Kenra, yeah, I, I got very lucky catching the, the giant snakehead. We should go for coffee. We haven't gone for coffee in a while. Oh, did it just come out today? Okay. <gasps> Phineas, give me a badge. <laughs> Doing as fine as always. It's a phone game? Yeah, I, um, I don't usually play very many phone games. But the one that I, I've only recently just downloaded, I haven't even touched it yet properly, but the one I've recently picked up is, um, it's called Elder Scrolls Blades. And apparently it's coming out for Switch in the fall, and apparently you're going to be able to transfer your save file over from the phone to the Switch or vice versa, I think. Which is intriguing to me, which is why I'm getting it now on the phone. Oh, BB, yeah, I got it on PC first. I do have it on Switch as well. I haven't touched on there yet because I heard about the loading times, but um, it's a really fun game. Tulips like orange, red, or white. Yeah, I had a suggestion for orange, was it orange, tulips, and yellow lilies or something like that for around the roost, so I might do that. That cool it's oh, frozen. Oh. Just a uh, coffee coffee sickle. <laughs> oh my goodness. What happens if I sit down again? I don't think I've ever tried that. I'll be waiting for you tomorrow. He's trying to limit my coffee intake. Let me have my coffee. Gosh darn it. <laughs> I was hoping he had different dialogue. Oh no, dagger! <laughs> Brewster with the intervention. Come on, Brewster, offer some iced coffee. That's true, actually. It's it's hot out. I mean, IRL, it's hot out. I don't know about in in game, but I assume it's a hot, muggy day. A banded dragonfly and the jewel bug. You just caught the j gosh darn it. 
I'm gonna do one more sweep around town and see if I can't find it. If not, it's fine. I'm just not mad. I'm disappointed. <laughs> Did you hear that? Did anyone else hear a bug fly away? That was probably it, wasn't it? I'm not mad. <laughs> oh, Andrew, I know, but I think we got everything from it. I think. We can do that now, actually. If you guys really want to, if Red Arrow is ready, and if Brewster will let us, we can do the coffee mini game. Yeah, sorry, you just like staring at that bug? You were. The town of my first move in is Julian. Oh, but he moved into a terrible spot, of course. Of course. I'm sorry to hear that. That always sucks. Well, this is a banded dragonfly and two paintings. Well, hopefully, you get uh, all of those soon. Alright, Red Arrow, are you ready? Uh, Magnus was here. Hopefully I'm saying that right. Thank you very much for the follow. Oh, maybe he doesn't want us to work for him today. Oh, wait. Yes, maybe. Alright, Red Arrow, are you ready? If you guys are new here, Red Arrow is our, like, designated coffee time person. <laughs> Alright. What is Colton like in this coffee, Red Arrow? Let's have the usual, he says. We don't know what the usual is, of course. <laughs> Magnus, hello, how are you doing today? Ah, uh, Kendra, you know what? I caught one earlier today and it didn't seem like it was that rare. Gilly and none, none, says Red Arrow. The good old days. <laughs> The usual. I just started working here. Do I know you? Like, do I know you? <laughs> Rock in front of the beach. Oh, that's awkward. <laughs> uh, Animoy, thank you very much for that follow. Cube. Does Cube like the same coffee as me? Coffee uniform is too cute. It is. It is. Kyle and Gaston from Random Movements. Oh, Gaston was amazing. Blend a little bit one spoonful. Never mind, he doesn't. <laughs> People like that. Sometimes you're on your first day of work and someone walks in asking for the usual. Yeah. People, ma'am. <laughs> Alright. Third, next up, we have... Uh, Marcel? He doesn't even live in this town. <laughs> With not too much milk. Okay. Right now, this is throwing you for a loop here. This is a villager we don't have. <laughs> Mocha, regular, two spoonfuls. Okay. You're kind of embarrassed in places. No, my usual? Yes. No, I know what you mean. Um, there was a subway at my college campus, and Mike and I used to go in there for lunch quite frequently. And it got to the point where they would see Mike and I, and they'd start prepping our subs before we got up there. And it was embarrassing. Mike loved it, but, like, I didn't. <laughs> I don't want to be noticed or remembered. Just magic, says Red Arrow. Oh, good news, yes. No, that happened to me too, and I'm like, oh, this is awkward. <laughs> oh, Rossetti. <laughs> Never regretty, you guys. Always Rossetti. Wait. Always regretty. Never Rossetti. There we go. Mm -hmm. 
Blue Mount, none and none. Thoughts, huh? I figured it was none and none. Yeah, really, it does, it does. This is before I really streamed actively, or at all, actually. Continuing relationship with white staff, I think it makes both of our days better? Yeah, for sure. Oh, Andrew. <laughs> you heard you'd be time traveling. Oh, this is the good stuff. Smooth, but with a little kick. Nice work, kid. I'll be back. See ya. I love his little legs. <laughs> He knows me by the face, he knows my usual pizza ingredients and is super sweet. Oh, that's cute. He's around by his stubby little legs. <laughs> there we go. We haven't done that in a really long time, so thank you again, Red Arrow. <laughs> And that was like the sole reason I uh, got all the stuff from that mini game. <laughs> what do you do with the coffee beans? Sell them. You can display them in your house as well, but they sell for a little bit, so why not? There we go. Make a coffee room. <laughs> Just have nothing but coffee beans everywhere. Have like the Brewstroids in there as a shrine to Brewster. Someone out there has done that. Guaranteed someone out there has done that. If I have a Bob shrine, there must be a, uh, a Brewster shrine. So guys, you guys know what this means. <laughs> I think I'm gonna wrap up today's stream here. Getting a little bit warm. It's finally caught up to me. Um, but I do want to thank you guys so very much for watching. I'm gonna go see if there's anyone online who we can give a host to here. Um, who's playing what today? Um, Liz is celebrating 1500 followers and She's playing The Sims 4, so we're gonna go over there and say hello. Give her all the love. She's a fellow member of Club Tortimer, the stream team I'm a part of. She's lovely, <laughs> uh, and she has a really cute dog, so you guys should go over and check her out. Um, yeah, thank you guys so very much for watching. Tomorrow I will be back for Mario Kart 8, I guess it is. It's Wednesday, isn't it? But uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys tomorrow.